So you're in the market for a greenhouse. Well, here at Growing Spaces, we have made the buying and building process as simple as possible for our customers. To start, we recommend taking a tour. Here at our Pagosa Springs facility, we have domes on site that are available for viewing. We also have a 26 foot growing dome in Golden, Colorado. If those options don't work for you, we can always try to find a dome owner in your area that's willing to show their dome, or you could view our virtual tours online to help you decide. Once you've decided on the size, our educated growing dome advisors will help you decide which options are best for your climate and gardening needs. We will put together an itemized quote for you, including delivery and installation. If you plan on applying for a building permit, we will provide you with a building department questionnaire for you to fill out. If there are any special modifications needed, we will work with our engineers to accommodate those and make those changes to your growing dome kit. There is a small fee associated with this, but we have been able to accommodate snow loads up to 175 pounds per square foot. That's a lot of snow. Our standard is 60 pounds per square foot. When it comes to foundation types, there are three basic options. The first and most cost effective is a gravel ring or a gravel pad. This is great for 15 through 26 foot growing domes, unless your building department has special requirements. Typically, concrete piers will help to satisfy those requirements and is what we recommend for the 33 and the 42 foot growing domes. But if you live in an especially cold climate or plan on installing a GAT system or a climate battery, you may want to consider an insulated concrete foundation or a concrete wall. You do need to decide whether that wall is going to be at grade or two feet above grade prior to purchasing your growing dome kit as it does change some of the components. When it comes to picking up your growing dome kit, you have a few options. You can come and pick it up at our facility with an enclosed trailer and a pickup truck. If you choose this option, we'll let you know of any size requirements at the time of purchase. If you only have a flatbed trailer, we are also able to crate your components. We also ship these domes in these crates all around the world. We calculate shipping costs based on your area code and will inform you of any requirements for the delivery process. For example, the 33 and the 42 do require a forklift to be present at the time of delivery. If you hire a Growing Spaces crew to complete your installation, we may elect to bring the dome kit with us. We do have a few installation options. You can either hire a supervisor, a supervisor plus one, or a full crew to complete your dome build. You may also elect to construct the dome yourself with the use of our detailed written instructions and corresponding videos. All of the pieces are pre-cut and labeled for ease of assembly. There are a few owner supplied items that are either too large or too expensive for us to ship with your kit. These items include the sheet metal for your pond, which is easily sourced at a local HVAC company, the corrugated tubing for your undersoil system, and rigid foam insulation that's easily obtained at a local hardware store, and a few other small items, but we provide you a detailed list with materials and quantities at the time of purchase. Once the dome has been constructed, designing the interior is entirely up to you. We do have some standardized cut lists for raised beds on our website as part of your written instructions. And we also have a raised bed gallery so you can get inspired and see what other dome owners have done. If these options don't work for you, we have partnered with Backyard Boxes who creates prefabricated cedar raised beds and they will ship to you partially assembled and are very easy to install. Soil is best purchased from a local nursery in bulk. That's gonna be the most cost effective and they can work with you to determine which mix will work best for your gardening needs, whether that's amended topsoil, raised bed mix, compost, or a mixture. You can also utilize hugel culture or the lasagna method to help further enrich your soil in your raised beds. And now comes the fun part, planting your crops so you can enjoy bountiful harvests for years to come. If you have any questions about the buying or building process, please reach out. We are available by email or phone, and you can also stop by to talk to us in person. Thank you so much for watching, and we look forward to helping you grow.